logically, we cannot always be connected to our networks, and so we won't always be connected to our online address book. So an offline address book can be very helpful because it provides us a copy when we're not connected. So as an administrator, an exchange administrator, how do we create, configure, and distribute these offline address books for our users? For starters, we have the default offline address book, and that's located under the Organization Configuration Work Center under Mailbox on the Offline Address Book tab. But if we wanted to create additional offline address books, we would use the wizard here, New Offline Address Book. If we select that, you'll notice that the wizard helps us to create a new offline address book. For starters, we would give it a name, and then we would have to choose the offline address book generation server. In this case, we only have the one server, so that's pretty easy to do. Now, it asks us if we want to include the global address list, and then if we want to include the following address list. So let's say if we have address lists that we've created. Here, our address list, we can do that, and we click OK. Now, if we have the global address list, we have all of the recipients that are part of the global address list. But in the event you turn this off, you might only want to include specific address lists. So this helps you to really narrow down what it is you're looking to accomplish by creating the offline address book. So let's just include the address list that we created and we'll click Next. Now we're asked about distribution points. Now we can enable web-based distribution, but this is only for clients that are running Outlook 2007. If we select this option, we would also have to select the virtual directory that it will be distributed from. If, however, we have Outlook clients that are 2003, Service Pack 1, or earlier, then we would want to select this option, Enable Public Folder Distribution. So let's assume that all of your clients are not completely up to date with Outlook 2007. We'll click Public Folder Distribution, and we'll click Next. Here we have the configuration summary. We click New. And there is our new offline address book. We click Finish, and there it is. So we hope you found that informative, and we'll see you in the next lesson.